what you need to do first is go and press and hold these two buttons the lower button and the upper button and you want to press and hold these two buttons together until the watch goes off and then the samsung logo appears and as soon as it appears you want to spam the home button until it goes into some kind of menu so let's do this okay so lower and upper button press and hold one two go there you go press and hold just ignore what you see on the screen just keep holding keep holding the screen goes dark let's wait for that samsung logo there you go release and spam the home button now when you spam the home button you're gonna see this menu so this is a menu you can scroll on okay and you just need to use this button to scroll okay don't try to use this one just scroll with this one and when you get to the end of the list it's gonna start from the top again so what you're looking for here is recovery okay so let's go and highlight recovery there you go so recovery is highlighted in blue so to select it now you need to long press on that button so a long press and then now your watch will boot into recovery mode so with the watch now in recovery mode you'll notice now you need to use this back button to scroll okay so this is the one that you use to scroll and there are plenty of options here you have this run graphics test you have run local test all these options here so what you're looking for here is the wipe data slash factory reset okay so once that is highlighted in blue then you select it using the home button so just press that it's going to ask you if you're sure so you want to scroll down again to confirm you want to factory data reset and then confirm again uh, or rather select that by using the home button and that's going to factory reset your watch okay now give it some time it's currently wiping data as you can see at the bottom once it's done it's going to give you back the same menu and all you have to do now is make sure reboot system now is highlighted and once again you can scroll with this if it's not highlighted so once reboot system now is highlighted select it using this button and that should reboot the watch and it's going to take you back to the original setup screen where you can set up your watch afresh so once the watch restarts you need your watch or rather your phone close by because you're going to start the whole setup process again okay now 